We are in an island view one bedroom at Kaloa Landing. So when you walk in, you have a closet on the right. And then you go right here into the kitchen. This is a one bedroom, but it is a full kitchen. You have a full refrigerator, a dishwasher, microwave, every, everything you need, and blender, toaster. And then you also have your um, dishes, cutlery, everything, which is a really nice feature of Kaloa Landing. So if you wanna cook some of your meals here, or if you have food allergies and really need to be careful about that, and need to cook some of your meals back um, at the resort, that's a really great option here. Another great feature that I love at Kaloa Landing is that every unit does have a washer and dryer. So you can pack a little lighter because you can do your laundry while you're here and you don't have to carry your laundry anywhere, which is really nice. Um, so this is a one bedroom. We'll go in the bedroom in a minute, but there is a pull-out sofa here. Sleeps or seats four at the table. There's also some bar stools. Now, if you have a larger family, they do have two and three bedrooms, or you could also connect to a studio in this particular room. So there's a lot of different configurations you can do if you have a large group or multi-generational or just groups of friends. There's a lot of things you can do to have your own privacy, but be able to connect when you want to. Uh, let's step out on the lanai really quickly. This is an island view, so that means there is no ocean view from this particular room. However, you do have ocean views around the resort. It is not oceanfront, but there are beautiful views at the resort. You still have a nice lanai. You can sit out here in the morning, drink your coffee, hear the birds. They also do have these studio and one bedrooms as well as the two and three bedrooms that do have that ocean view as well or what they call a coastline view. So let's go into the bedroom. You have a king bed here as well as another access to the lanai. You have plenty of drawer and storage space, another TV, and then there is a bathroom in here. There's a large soaking tub, there's a sink. There is a door that closes here into the other side of the bathroom. So it's a very large, large bathroom. There's a walk-in shower here, another sink, and a toilet. So overall, I, I think I said already, this is about 800 square feet. It really feels bigger, the space is utilized really well, and this will sleep up to four guests.